I've missed each and every one of you and I was saying it's my bad yes it's been long I posted you know I updated a YouTube video why it's because uh, I've been busy I've had a lot on my plate guys and I'm really sorry that is about to change because I'm gonna be giving you back to back new gist I wanted to say amiibo but new gist let's make it Push. anyway guys if you're yet to subscribe to my youtube video all you need to do is click on that subscribe button and then you have subscribed and you get to have notifications anytime i drop a new video meanwhile let's quickly go on with your stride welcome back guys welcome to just stride okay so what's been you know making the rounds of social media is the fact that uh, a wristwatch seller actually called out Peter of Peace Square saying that he is wearing a fake Richard Mill wristwatch and I'm like ah, which one is fake now eh because um, I've heard uh, of David o having bought that same wristwatch for like one point something million I don't know how much exactly and then now he's saying that Peter of Peace Square is wearing a fake Richard Mill wristwatch now that wristwatch is said to have cost like um, 233,000 US dollars. That's the one that Peter Pisco is wearing, right? $233,000. And if I know my math correctly, it's over 89 million naira. I'm like, for a wristwatch. Why would I? I don't get it. Okay, imagine that he's wearing a wristwatch of 10,000 naira. It is fake. Why is it fake? That is why I want to keep these odds our celebrities. We just hide them to one, you know, level that once they do something beneath that set standard, they are now known for wearing fake things. Fake. Do you want these people to keep them safe? Don't let them commit suicide for us. Leave them alone. See, uh, Peter Peace Square, if you like, wear the one of 10,000, 15,000, 10,000, 5,000. We love you like that. We love you like that. Anyways, let me not dwell too much on this. Geez. Let me go straight. To what is buzzing and that is about Rema and okay this is what went down <clears throat> during the uh, BB Ninja final party uh, it was said that Lekor and some of the other BB Ninja housemates wanted to take a picture with Rema but Rema's uh, bodyguards just brushed off you know this guy saying that no don't take a picture of Rema and all that you know this whole celebrity standard and stuff and then David o got pissed and gave Rema a very dirty hot slap like I don't know if it's one or twice like, <laughs> anyways that was tweeted by a guy called Fola now Fola later retweeted that it was a joke and like it was a lie and, and I'm wondering why would you want to tarnish someone's image or do you want these two celebrities to start you know fighting is would you be happy like why would someone do to me that's a very stupid and silly joke like you joke about somebody slapping someone else that thing actually trend and that tweet trended for a very long time like it's super annoying really now davido replied for that now let's hear what davido has to say about it actually not fair bro because people actually believed you you we we humans too my guy so guys you've heard what the video has to say they're humans too that's what i keep telling you guys each and every time these guys are humans like us you don't just go out and just say something now let's leave that let's leave the whole celebrity uh, stuff aside me and you like we normal people and celebrity guys anyways so some of your friends say some silly things and then they end up telling you it's just a joke there are certain things that shouldn't be a joke you should always know your limits like there are limits to things anyway guys if you have any comments as regards this gist all you need to do is drop your comment below and i'll get right back to you asap moving on to guys that this video i would love for you guys to really watch and try to understand but before then i have to give you a breakdown of the whole gist now this is about a covenant student that went back to school and she said their school uh, covenant university is actually not conducting covid19 tests rather they are doing drug and um, pregnancy tests and they were lied their parents were lied to that this student 
will do a COVID-19 test, which they actually paid for. And this particular student videoed the whole thing and, you know, went ahead to, you, you know, talk about it on social media. She even said that it rained, that it rained for like two days and they were packed under a canopy and they were just too much of them. Meanwhile, guys, let me quickly read a tweet of what she said before we watch that video. They brought out only two canopies to search and test us. We were so we were so many. Rain fell and they left us under the rain. Our pos our provisions were destroyed and luggages soaked to the last. All right, guys, let's quickly watch that you know video of what she just uh, said in a tweet, and we'll be right back. guys having watched that video what do you guys think like uh what do you think about private universities state universities and um federal universities what do you guys what's your take on you know these three categories of tertiary institutions all right i would like you guys to drop your comments you know i know that your heads are spinning with different thoughts so just convert those thoughts into comments and drop them right below in the comment section and i'll reply you asap meanwhile guys i've been telling you to patronize me like each and every time I come, you know, online. So, guys, please try as much as possible to follow me on my business Instagram handle at MelJoyCNB. And I've had some, I have some wonderful, you know, products right here displayed behind me, like you can see. Now, this is, uh, okay, let me try to see if I can get it. Ah, uh, so, um, I'll be bringing them out. This is Hemp Spam. And then I've got this beautiful glass bag. Now, this is not the um, soft one or the close one. This is like the solid one, like you can see in the picture. So, guys, try as much as possible to patronize your girl. And I have so much more in these boxes. I have much, 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 much products, like good, legit product that you guys need to buy from me and remember that festive season is fast approaching and things are going to be very expensive so you guys try as much as possible to get this at discounted rates because you watched my youtube video you're going to get it at very cheap price all right guys this is me saying chala 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 we'll come to the end of today's you know video so this is me saying bye guys my legendary kiss of course mm -hmm.